Hello everybody, Mr. Bright Guy here for hopefully the final session of Kingdom Hearts 1.5 Final Mix. Now, we don't have very much left to do, so all we gotta figure out is to seal Hollow Bastion's keyhole and do some optional stuff here and there. Like, there's actually some optional bosses you can do in this game that probably didn't show up in the original version. And it probably shows up in the Final Mix version. For example, like, uh, in if we look at the stock here... Um... Dark Manor? Nah. There was, like, some materials you can grab in this game that weren't in the original version, but only show up in the Final Mix version. And there was some other stuff that doesn't show up in the original version too. Like I think there's two optional keyblades that you can grab. Or like two additional keyblades you can get in this game. So we're gonna get through this as fast as possible. I What I did manage though after the last recording session is make a new save file to grind as much as I can to level 100. And that's going to be changed at some point throughout this game, so... I should know what I... I know what I should be doing from here to the save point. So I have to talk to Sid first about this... Uh, piece or whatever. I need to go back to Hollow Bastion. I don't think I can let you do that, kid. The Heartless there are multiplying by the minute. Lady, your ship up. Then what can we do? Simple. Go around them instead of through. Install a new navigation gummy and take a new route. A new gummy? From where? The secret waterway. When I came here nine years ago, I stored it there in case I ever needed it. <laughs> that was a weird animation turnaround. Never thought a kid would be the one to use it. So yeah. I do believe... So wait a minute. I think we already did find the second piece to it. I'm pretty sure. There was like a two piece before where it had like one to go to Halloween Town. And one to go to Atlantica. And I think we already did that part. So ow. Fuck. Jesus, that's kind of loud. So, at this point, ever since your first visit through Hollow Bastion, every single world has these kinds of Heartless. So, like, the mages, the guys with the shields, like the big bulldogs, uh, the giant wyverns, and also the, uh... Uh, what were they? The, the, uh, the ghouls. <laughs> the grab by the ghoulies. So you go into the secret waterway, and it's actually found here. So you would remember coming here, seeing Leon and Aerith down here, talking about a navigation, like what are navigation gummies? And you would notice this hallway down here where it had a moon in it. But now it's turned into a sun, so we just go down here. Well now it's back to a moon. You would, you would probably figure that out, like, a, the second time you come here. Like, why is this different? And you go check it out. And that's where the last navigation gummy is. But what? Why is Kyrie down here? <laughs> I don't understand. Let's go back and join the others. We should rest up. Okay. So this cutscene. Oh, your grandma's story, right? That's right. Wait. We were together. You know what's funny? I looked everywhere for you, but you were with me all along. Oh. Finally, we're together, Kyrie. Now it's time to get Riku back. You think it'll ever be the same again between us? Riku's lost his. When I turned into a Heartless, 
You saved me, remember? <laughs> I was lost in the darkness. I couldn't find my way. As I stumbled through the dark, I started forgetting things. My friends, who I was, the darkness almost swallowed me. But then I heard a voice. Your voice. You brought me back. I didn't want to just forget about you, Sora. I couldn't. That's it. Our hearts are connected. And the light from our hearts broke through the darkness. I saw that light. I think that's what saved me. No matter how deep the darkness, a light shines within. I guess it's more than just a fairy tale. <laughs> well, let's go. You can't go. Why not? Because it's way too dangerous. <laughs> nice hey, excuse. Sora, we made it this far by sticking together. You can't go alone. Kairi, even if we're apart, we're not alone anymore, right? I can't help? You'd kind of be in my way. Wow, Sora. Okay. You win. Take this. Aww. It's my lucky charm. Be sure to bring it back to me. Don't worry. I will. Wasn't that the uh, thing she was making back at Destiny yes. Island? Probably. Don't ever forget. Wherever you go, I'm always with you. That's adorable. So now we get an Oathkeeper Keyblade, which is probably not the best Keyblade so far. But it's from Kairi. Sora, Kairi, I'm sorry. Is this the afterworld? I'm not ready. Not yet. Not until I see Sora and Kairi one last time. Riku, can you hear me? I'll be there soon. Who is that? I have the other Keyblade. The one that belongs to this world. I've been trying to get through to you, but the darkness in your heart kept me away. Who are you? What's happened to me? Your heart won the battle against the darkness, but it was too late for your body. That's why you're here, in this place of darkness where hearts are gathered. So what do I do? The door of darkness will open soon, but it's a door we can't enter. It has to be closed from both sides. To do this, you need two keys and two hearts. Maybe you're here for the same reason I am. Maybe it was fate. Fate, huh? You seem to know everything, don't you? Then tell me. Are Sora and Kairi okay? Don't you feel the echoes of their hearts? You already know the answer. Look inside your own heart. Okay. <laughs> no, I'm not sure why that cutscene was muted. But it had, like, sound effects in it. So... I'm actually kind of fucking sad that didn't actually happen in this, like, a second time. But there was... A very infamous moment whenever it happens in Kingdom Hearts stream uh, speedruns. That in that one cutscene where Sora and Kairi are talking together, you would see Sora just glitch out of the cutscene and he would just like be in his battle pose stance, just off in the distance somewhere. And I got I gotta like put it up on the video like in comparison between what was actually happening in the cutscene to the glitched cutscene. And I'm pretty sure it only happens one time. 
I'm pretty sure it only happens one time in this save file or something like that. Or like one... Yeah, I think it only just happens in one run or something. But yeah, you can have like Sora glitch out of the cutscene and... It, I thought... When I played it last time, I was like, what the fuck? Oh shit, I know this! I know this glitch! <laughs> and I thought like I could move around and shit. I was just like, oh man, this is hilarious. I, I wish this, <clears throat> I wish this would happen in recording, but no, it, it doesn't happen again. Uh, it doesn't happen again, unfortunately. But I will show it when I've when I'm done editing through this uh, let's play. You found it. All right, I'll go fix your ship. All set. You can get. You can get going any time. Kid, I gotta say, I wish you didn't have to face all this danger. Me too, Sid. Me too. In fact, I wish it wasn't gonna crash at this point. Oh, by the way, this treasure chest here, the one that can't open, there must be some secret to opening it. I tried after many visits coming across here to figure out how to get rid of all these candles because I think that's the key to opening the chest. All you have to do... Deep freeze. See ya. Deep freeze. is use blizzard. All you have to do is use a blizzard spell on the candles and you can take them all out at the same time. And you get a defense up. You get a defense up after all that. Alright, let's go back to Hall of Bastion. So now there's a new warp hole near Traverse Town. I wonder where it leads. Some weird powers emanating from the worlds. Might be worth revisiting some places again. I think what they were saying is that there's some optional bosses around here, so there is one in Neverland, and there's one in Agrabah. And I think there's one in... oh yeah, Olympus Coliseum. So in order to get back to Hall of Bastion, you can see it's not linked anywhere. You have to actually do a normal drive through the wormhole that actually takes you to Hall of Bastion. And I'm gonna skip this part because it's actually a long ride there. It's actually a long joy ride there. In fact, I think it's the last one in the game. And of course it has to be like the longest one in the game too. <clears throat> All right, we should be almost there now. It's just past this yellow thing here. If I could just make it past. Okay, thank God. I thought it was gonna. I thought it wasn't gonna crush any of that. All right, we made it to Hollow Bastion again. Eight hundred new high score. Woohoo! Where's Bell? Still in the castle. Against her will? No. I think she stayed for a reason. The other princesses are inside as well. <coughs> Let's go ask them. You may need my strength. I'll go with you. Alright, Beast. Since you... Since pretty much you... Can't do anywhere else around this uh, around this game. Like you're the only one that's available in the, in this one. I would think so because your world has been destroyed. And if I do, rem well, like maybe some worlds get recovered after this one. But I know you can go through Beast Castle in Kingdom Hearts too. Like, maybe some worlds get recovered by darkness after this. So yeah, we're going back to Hollow Bastion. And I was seeing some videos of, like, other Kingdom Hearts games, and I had... 
I guess I was a, probably a little bit too obvious that this place might not be Radiant Garden, but this place is actually relatively close to where Radiant Garden actually is. In fact, I think they're in the same world, too. So before I go up to see the princesses, there actually is one in this library. And we have to actually know which princess actually has a horny spot for libraries. I guess I wasn't going to say that. I'm just going to have to cut that off. You've come to seal the keyhole, right? Please be careful. The darkness is raging deep inside. We've been holding it back. But we can't hold out much longer. We'll take care of it. But yeah. <laughs> Show a princess what she really wants. A big room full of books. That'll get her attention. Hmm. So if you do talk to Belle here, she actually gives you a keyblade that comes from her world. Called the Divine Rose. And I do believe up to this point, I think it's one of the best keyblades in the game. Yeah, it, it has like... Plus three strength from the Olympia Keyblade. Also has like... I think... That's as much strength as it is. Like 13 and this one's 10. I think like the 40 and 43 one is like a combined strength from like... Equipment and... Um, ability... Well not abilities. Um, leveling up. So now... Gonna have to make a huge climb here. And I sh I actually should be able to know where I should go here. Since I now know this, uh... Since I now know this place off by heart. <laughs> see what I did there? Off by heart. 